Hello everyone, Frozen Cars here, and welcome to some more Tag Force 3. In the last episode, we wrapped up Zane's story, which was really funny, and I really enjoyed that one. Uh, and uh, this week, we are going to be teaming up with Blair now, again. Now, this version of Blair is like, I think like her Season 1 version? So, this is the one I was afraid of, the most going to be afraid of, because she has Maiden in Love as her whole shtick. But, uh, hopefully, it won't, this story won't be too bad. <laughs> In ter not in terms of like the story content, but just in terms of dealing with her playstyle and my playstyle. <laughs> uh, so for this for this episode, what we're going to be doing is I'm going to be running Light Swords. Hopefully they work. They probably will, especially if I get Judgment Dragon out, and we'll have no problems. So if you're enjoying this series and you want to see more, be sure to like down below and subscribe if you haven't already. We are slowly marching our way to. 1,500 subscribers. If we can get to 2,000 by the end of the year, I'll be really happy. But uh, it's a long shot, but I, I hope so. It'll be kind of cool. Uh, alright, well, let's begin. Hey, I've got some major news. Get up! I said, get up! I heard that Zane is at Obelisk Blue. Let's go, hurry up! Don't tell me you don't know who Zane is. He's a pro duelist who graduated at the top of his class from the academy. Don't you remember? We just saw him defeat Aster in a live Pro League duel on TV. He looks so cool. Oh. <laughs> uh oh. Oh. Oops. I don't have time to get lost in thought. We have to go see Zane and fast. Oh, that's right. So this, this version, uh, she, uh, she's all about Zane instead of, uh, Jaden. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. I see. Well, where's Zane? I don't see him anywhere. I know my source is reliable. Where is he? Aw, I'm going to look inside. Uh oh, I don't think that's... <laughs> I don't think that's right. Hey, wait a minute! No trespassing! Only the elite can come in here. I'm just going in for a minute. Third-rate duelists like you shouldn't even be allowed near here. How rude. I'll have you know that I'm a first-rate fan of Zane's. I think that's besides the point. I guess the truly stupid ones don't even realize how stupid they are. Wow, okay. I don't like picking on the weak, but you leave me no choice. There's only one way to prove our point to idiots like you. Let's duel. Huh? But we don't have time to duel you one at a time. Make it a tag duel. We'll take you both on. You'll soon learn your place. Hey, what's with all this wee business? Alright, so if I beat you, I'll be a first-rate duelist, right? The odds are against that are astronomical, but yes. Okay, let's do this, Chorus. If we beat these two, we can get closer to Zane. A maiden in love is stronger than a rampaging bull. Well, I guess that makes me a bullfighter. What's up with you two? <laughs> it's just like, what? That poor guy. He just gets roped into this. Uh, well, isn't that always the case? Oh, come on. Uh. Ah, yeah, there we go. Rock has never failed me. Well, I don't know. All right, light swarms. Let's do this. Ah, uh, I, I I love using light swarms. It's my it's definitely my favorite archetype. One of my favorite. I think I've said that already. <laughs> All right, let's duel. Ooh, wait. Is that a silent magician? Huh. Okay. So she's running Silent Magician? I always found it interesting that they never, you know, sent her back home, <laughs> even though she is way too young to be part of Duel Academy. She does have her whole maiden thing going on. My turn. Ooh. Starting off strong, we got Lila, we got uh Oh, hmm. Alright. I'm gonna set you. Uh yeah, no, I don't wanna use Lumia yet. 
Oh, I could have bribed Jane, too. That's okay. Uh, there he is. Alright, Luminous Spark. And let's swing. I didn't do a lot, but that's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You bring out another giant rat, most likely. Yeah. Which is great for not... for whatever that trap was. Oh, there goes a Judgment Dragon. That's okay. We only have... we have two of them. What do you what, what do you have? Ooh, shining angel. Okay. But not DD warrior lady. You wouldn't summon out the DD warrior lady. Okay. Pop that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know all about Mr. Rat. Oh, he runs zombies. Okay. Destroy that. Alright. Alright, that was a solid turn. Where we're doing good. Yeah, 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 okay. <laughs> Ooh, ouch! Yikes. That sucks. Oh, there it is. Two Maiden in Loves. Wow. Lord have mercy. Oh. UFO turtle? Oh my... What? That was foolish. What was that supposed to be? Spirit Reaper? Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, I, lo I have wolf! No! <laughs> God damn you, wolf. Uh, that's the worst. That is the worst thing to draw. Uh. Yes, I don't have any lice ones in my deck. I mean, in my graveyard. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have summoned it then. Oh well. Ah, I didn't mean to attack that. Huh. That was my fault. I meant to attack the shiny angel. God damn it. So they just have a lot of these monsters that just love coming out in the field like that. That's a little annoying, not gonna lie. Alright. Ooh, that sucks. And I lost both of my dragons in there. They are both in there. Are you shitting me? Come on, man. Now I'm gonna lose my Lumia. Oh, God damn it. That, that is... That sucks. And there's Marshmallon. <laughs> Why would you just summon Marshmallon like that? What the hell? What kind of nonsense? Why would you just summon Marshmallon? Another shiny angel. Pop that. Alright. Oh, okay. I like that. That's very smart. Why didn't he use it before? That's interesting. Okay, I like that. I like that. That's using the, using the good old noodle. And we have... Oh, was she trying to bait that? No. That'd be way too... That'd be way too smart for the AI. Ooh. Goodbye. Now, the only problem is that Spirit Reaper. That is the only problem we have, is that Spirit Reaper. Uh, which means I'll just do this. Use Foolish Burial to get rid of Wolf. Here comes the big one! Here comes the boy! There we go! 
Yeah, I can't attack this thing, can I? I don't... Wait. Yeah, no, he takes no battle damage, right? Yeah, okay. Alright, Lila. Alright, so now you just have to attack me. Attack that face down so I can get rid of that Spirit Reaper. Uh... What's this? Um... Never is just since your opponent takes of you, your opponent takes battle damage that would take him in this battle. Uh you know what? I can I, I can I can I'm okay with that. Oh, there she is. There's the maiden in love. Pop that. Very good. Oh wow, she has a magic cylinder. Oh my god. Yep, there it is. There's our combo. But I think we should be fine. So now it's, she's not going to take any kind of battle damage. And she gets counters. And depending on how many counters she gets, she's able to, like, steal cards or stuff like that, if I remember correctly. But I, I don't think it'll come to that at this stage. We, we, we got this. Especially with, like, that dimensional prison. It's only 900, but it's okay. It's, it's, it's chip damage, but it's good chip damage. Yeah, this thing gave me so much problems. I think it was in Tag Force 1 or 2 when I first dueled against her, and I was like, oh my god, why is this so difficult? And I was still running, like, that really... <laughs> that unoptimized water deck, because I didn't get enough cards for it to like finish it but yeah I think we're doing pretty good all right oh another one nice yeah if an equipped monster attacks a monster with a maiden counter on it the controller of the equipped monster takes battle damage take control of the monster then inflicts battle damage plays life points at the end of the yeah that's basically what it's all about and it's so interesting because like it wouldn't work the way the meta is now <laughs> oh my Another... really? Ugh, this guy just can't take a hint. Get out of here. You have... I can just kill you with just two monsters. Ugh. Ugh, this is so... Ah, he's living for one more turn, oh my gosh. I could have easily... Too bad I couldn't use Solemn Judgment for those effects, huh? Alright. Well, that's smart. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> we, we got this. Oh my god, is that another one of those cards? No, it isn't. Okay. I was about to say, like, if that was it, I would be really mad. Alright. Alrighty. Easy peasy. You beat us! It, it can't be! That's the power of maiden love, chumps. Now, if it's alright with you, I'll be going inside. I'm coming, Zane. Sorry, but you just missed him. What? Zane already has already left. What? Where did he go? <laughs> you really want to know? What's with that laugh? What are you, a villain? Creepy. If you want to know, you must defeat us in a duel. Oh, come on! Alright, enough is enough. Zane said he had a pro league duel, so he went home. But he said he would be back in a few days. I see. Well, I'm not giving up. Not as long as Zane is coming back here. Hey, if he went back for a pro league duel, that means he'll be on TV. Let's hurry, Chorus. I have to set my DVD player to record Zane's victory. See you later.
Uh, all right. A maiden in love, eh? I think I know why they name hurricanes after women now. <laughs> Running away with your tail between your legs, are you? Dude, she's already gone. <laughs> well, what was that? What was that epilogue? I didn't expect that. All right. Hey, he's finally here. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! I heard that Zane has come back to the academy again. They say he's over by the lighthouse. Let's go! Hurry up! Oh, she doesn't even know about the whole rumor behind the lighthouse either. All right. Well, let's go meet Zane. Huh? Where's Zane? Oh, he left a minute ago. Dang, we keep missing this guy. What? He said he had an interview early tomorrow morning. Aww. Just what kind of relationship do you have with Zane? How do you know... How do you know all about his schedule? Hmm? Answer me that. Huh? W well, we were just talking here for a minute. We used to talk every night when Zane was at the academy. Oh. <laughs> I guess he just wanted to come by and see how things were. You know, for old time's sake. That's all. Every night with Zane? I won't stand for it. It's not fair. I... I... I came to this island just for the purpose of meeting Zane. I dream about him every night. Okay. <laughs> and yet, I can't seem to meet him. Okay, but that doesn't have anything to do with me. You don't deserve to be with him. What has... What have you done to deserve it? Duel me. If I win, you have to leave Zane alone. What's that? Did I hear the word duel? Oh, brother. <laughs> Jaden? Let me join in. I was just talking to Zane. What? It really got me thinking about old times. About all of the duels we had. It got me in the mood for a duel. <laughs> Uh-oh. I can't believe this. I've been trying to meet Zane for so long. What's wrong? You look a little strange. Do you have an upset stomach? Uh, Jaden. Alright. I have no choice. I'll just have to show you both the true power of a maiden in love. A maiden in love is more frightening than a blazing fire. Somehow, I think there's been a misunderstanding here. Several, actually. But it looks like there's no reasoning with you while you're this upset. Okay, I'll duel you. Me too! We'll make it a tag duel with the four of us! <laughs> oh god. Oh no. Oh wow, Rock once again has not led me astray. Yes, very good. All right. All right, Blair, don't, don't, don't fuck up. <laughs> don't fuck it up. Let's do this. Ooh, did I? S as long as I don't draw my wolves, I'm happy. Eh, it's not a bad. Eh, it's not a bad. It's not a bad hand. I would. Uh, huh? What's that? Excuse me? What kind of? I have never seen her use that before. Has she always had that card? I've never seen that in my life. Oh, so you're not gonna bail me out, huh? Okay, that's fine. I, as I said before, usually I'm more scared of Jaden when he's got when he starts getting going with his uh, elemental heroes. But he only has six in his extra deck. So what kind of, so what kind of, so what is he running with? Oh, but they're gonna get popped. Oh, they're gonna get popped. So it doesn't matter to me. Denied. All right. So who do I want to bring out? Oh, yes. Finally, I could. Dr I finally drew one. Lord have mercy, you have no idea how much ha how happy that makes me. Uh, yeah, I don't have any of that. Come out, Lila. Now, unfortunately, I don't trust any of those face downs. So, I'm going to pop one of these. Which one was it? Ha! I knew it! I had a sneaking suspicion. That's okay. Because now, eventually, we will have enough to bring out my Judgment Dragon. And I... Shall be very happy. Ooh, okay. Com 
Man Knight. Ha! Negate. Thank you very much. None of that, please. And I'll let Miss Maiden do her thing. <laughs> she couldn't do shit! Uh, I don't know, maybe next turn I should destroy that other face down. Just cause I don't like it. I, I don't like that face down. It's probably torrential tribute or something. Never mind. <laughs> Only 400. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah, I might next time. I might pop that other. Ooh, it's Mr. Woodsman? Okay. Yeah, I figured you would just go after Lila. It makes sense. I would. Ooh, wait a minute. Uh, discard. Would this be enough? I think I'll get rid of Gareth. And then Jane. Oh, just enough. That's awesome. Just enough. That makes me happy. Say goodbye. What? Oh. Uh, I was gonna say, like, <gasps> what? I was I was so afraid he had Starlet Road, but I was like, wait a minute, why would he have Starlet Road? That makes no sense. <laughs> For some reason my brain was like, Starlet Road. That, that was the that's that was the first thing he came to I was like, no, impossible. He doesn't have Starlet Road. This is Tag Force 3, not Tag Force 5 or 4 or 6. <laughs> uh I my my heart skipped a beat. I was like, what? How? What? How did we? How we? Why would he have that? This is one of those try hard decks. Those try hard meta decks that happens if you have like a forbidden card in your deck or something like that. Is that, is that what it is? No. Whew. Come on, Wolf. Oh come on, Wolf Doko. Oh there he is, Wolf Doko. There he is, my boy. There he is. Next turn, it's over. Because I have bottomless and she tries to attack me or whatever. Son of a bitch! Okay. Well, maybe not. No, even if I do nuke the whole field, even if I nuke the whole field, she only has 2,900, so one judgment attack and it's over. Yes! Yeah, I'm clearly carrying her. I, I, I so am. Oh my gosh, she really... Oh, she was just like, nope, I'm not playing. Time to pop. Time to destroy the field. Good day. And that's game. That was hella fast. Very good. Very, very good. Alright. Ah. Well, we showed her. Well, I showed them the power of a maiden in love. <laughs> uh, all right. Ugh. Oh man, you got us. That's the power of a maiden in love. Please listen to me. Zayn and I are just... Nothing you can say will change my mind. I'm going to keep chasing Zane to the ends of the earth. And sooner or later, he will pick me over the likes of you. <laughs> oh, I just remembered. If he went home for an interview, he'll probably be in next month's Dueling Digest. I'll have to reserve 30 issues or so at the school store. See you later. What? Oh, this is going to be another epilogue? So, that's the power of Maiden in Love, huh? That's kind of like a truck with its brakes out. <laughs> You really don't get it, do you? <laughs> no, he doesn't. He's in, he is typical Shodan protagonist. Completely unaware. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Next episode, we'll wrap up Blair's story. This has been really fun so far. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, maybe subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys next time.